Hello guys. So I was playing Septech and I came across something that I could not find a good tutorial on. So I'm going to do that here. So this is the maze in the Twilight Forest. Um, we're going to be, sh I'm going to show you how to get to the, the vault, which is right here. So I'm on the second level down in the maze. Once you find it, um, it'll look like this, just a solid gray wall room. Uh, to make this map, you just need the maze focus and eight paper. And then you just have to walk around and it'll uncover. Um, now I am in creative, so I can instant break these blocks. But when you're in vanilla, these two are your best options at this age in SevTech. Um, this will change depending on what mod pack you're playing. But I use the uh, quart, the black quartz, all the all the tools. A I O T. I don't remember what that stands for, but um. I found this might actually be a better tool for this. Now this is a creative spawn tool, so the stats are not what you'll get, but these are your two options. So to tackle this, you wanna go down one and go in. Gotta do it slowly. All right, do not break this block. You want to break the TNT. And actually, I can show you what this looks like. Nope. Mode three. There we go. So this is what it looks like. This is the vault. So, up, up, so you got pressure plates here, which if a block lands on it, it will trigger it. Above this block here, there's sand, which when it falls, it'll uh, convert to an item a dropped item and land on the pressure plate and trigger it. On all four sides, pretty much under the pl pressure plates, there's TNT. Uh, there's none in the corners. But to do this, you go down here and you're gonna break the TNT all the way around. Honestly, you probably don't have to go all the way around, but I'm doing it just to be safe. Uh, let me get a torch. Now this is gonna go a lot slower when you're using a pickaxe. Like I said, I'm in creative, so it makes it a little bit faster. That's it. And then if you want, just break this block. Make sure, if you don't want to break the TNT, you can break that block and you can access the chest, which here's the maze breaker. This is what you're mainly going after on top of all this other stuff. Collect it. You can get some good stuff out of this. Punch two, infinity. Um, fortune two, oh, that's the maze breaker. Now, technically, you can access all of this, like, from here. Yeah, that's good stuff. But, yeah, that's how you do it. Um, yeah, once you break the TNT, you can break these. It doesn't bother it. I did want to show you the sand, so... you break If you dig in and break this block, sand and triggers it. And there's sand all the way around. I believe, yeah, there's bedrock. So technically, I guess you could. No, because it, well, you may be able to do it that way. Because the Block would be here, the sand would be above it. So you'd have to remove the sand. So yeah, just don't go just straight onto it like this. 
that'll take you straight to the pressure plate and all that. But yeah, that's how you do it. Thanks for watching. Bye.